So give me a few morsels of time to break down this concept of stay free because free means not under the control or in the power of another, able to act or be done as one wishes. To stay free once you are free. And I go back to 1962 in my mind's eye that, that icy cold waters in San Francisco where the Anglin brothers and Frank Morris made that infamous escape attempt from Alcatraz. To this day, I wonder if those men are alive. Anytime they hear a siren, do they look over their shoulder? They, they've been gone for decades, but are they truly free? Or that gentleman that just got apprehended in Pennsylvania, they picked up his heat signature and surrounded him. And he was gone and escaped from jail after a two-week manhunt. They, they closed in on him. But was his freedom that he got artificially ever real freedom? So our message is that once you get free and once you've paid your debt to society, then you need to stay free, to stay out of the control of another. And so you've got to make sure that you're doing the things that are necessary not to just get free, you know, pay your, your fine, make parole, bail, etc. cetera. Not, not just the things to get free. But you got to be just as tenacious and exacting to stay free.